Welcome to Two Sips with Todd. I'm Todd Strange, mayor of the great city of Montgomery, Alabama. You know, during the summertime, uh, we got kids uh, out of school, and really we've had a wonderful opportunity this summer to uh, interact with our children in so many ways. Uh, just a couple of weeks ago, uh, we were at the, uh, the Brain Forest, uh, which was a, a program at Carver School for about 200 kids uh, that uh, really kept them from losing their mental capacity over the, the summer. As a matter of fact, they even gained some of the time they uh, had there. It was a wonderful, wonderful uh, opportunity for kids to, to uh, be enriched and parents really enjoyed uh, that opportunity as well. And I want to commend the Montgomery Education Foundation and those that have uh, participated in that. It was a great opportunity for our kids to have a wonderful uh, summer camp. Uh, with education as the uh, hallmark because what happened was they went to school in the mornings and then in the afternoon they were able to enjoy outdoors recreation whether it be horseback riding, dancing, or the traditional uh, sports that we had. Also uh, just yesterday we had uh, around 400 um, mid-schoolers uh, mid uh, who were at a uh, Let's Talk Don't Shoot uh, conflict resolution seminar put on by Montgomery Police Department. Uh, a great time. We had so many mentors and role models and uh, had even some kids that had been in trouble to, to give testimonials. So it was a great time for these kids to really have their eyes open and see what it's like uh, to be on the straight and the narrow. And this is just but one of, of several that we're going to have. I think we want to move it up next, uh, next time to our senior highs and then come back with our junior highs uh, as well, our middle school as, as we talked about. And then just today, we were at uh, Brubaker uh, for a summer enrichment program. They had 100-plus uh, kids, really have been hearing from leaders around our community, our superintendent and, and some others. I had the opportunity today to talk about uh, leadership and, and leadership characteristics, and they were so bright and, and so uh, participant. Uh, participatory. It really uh, uplifts you to see the quality of these kids. And speaking of quality of our kids, uh, there's a young man that's in LAMP. As a matter of fact, he's going into his senior year. He made a perfect score on both the o ACT and the SAT. Less than 300 people in the entire United States of America do that. He can write his own college. So that's just to tell you that we do have good opportunities for public education. We've got a challenge to do it. We're working on those. We need to expand our magnets. We need to, to get into a full service community schooling where we can get the entire community involved. And those are some of the initiatives that we're working with the Board of Education to implement uh, coming this next school year. In addition to all of the things we've talked about, we've had a, uh, a youth initiative this summer through our Parks and Rec with really as a coordinator with so many partnerships, whether it be boys and girls clubs or YMCAs or some of our churches um, along the way. Uh, we'll, we'll probably touch uh, 18 to 20,000 lives uh, this year and probably serve close to 200,000 meals. This is all an opportunity to have some summer fun and give them things to do and to get them off the street so that they can be active and engaged and not just sitting around the house watching TV or playing on their computers, challenging them to get into some of the academics that they might lose uh, along the way. As we close, I want to once again congratulate that young man at uh, LAMP, Grant Prater. He scored a perfect uh, on the SAT and the um, ACT. Uh, he will write his own ticket to any college he wants to go to in the world. So congratulations, Grant, and best wishes on a great senior year at LAMP and your future endeavors in college.